and do a how I learned to talk CSS, but then I decided to troll everyone instead. Um, I wrote this on Twitter the other day and people liked it. So Bootstrap, the finest library ever. Four, because four is awesome. React, like, who, who can't love this? Um, I was actually asking one of my mates who is working on a really awful project and someone said, why can't we just use um, Bootstrap instead of writing actual CSS? Um, so that, that's where I came up with this idea. So this library, which doesn't exist, shakes trees. So you know, everyone talks about low-hanging fruit. You shake the tree, the low-hanging fruit comes down. Um, it hoists scope. I don't actually know what that means, but it does it because you need that. Um, it splits code because when code t stays together too much, it gets uncomfortable. <laughs> it adds dead code because every library needs to have some legacy. Otherwise, what are you doing? You know? Adds extra critical paths because, you know, single point of failure? Nah, we've got lots of points of failure. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> that you made up just now? <laughs> well, minification is made up, so maximification, maximification is the opposite. It's going to be the new thing. If you use um, Angular, you're already there. <laughs> Everyone's pushing HTTP 2, but uh, 3, think ahead, everyone. If your library does not support three, then you know it's not defined yet, but that's okay. <laughs> How did this come to be? Thanks to <laughs> Chian. <laughs> Is this popular yet? Yes. <laughs> Is this serious? Probably not. Um, just go learn Grid, and then you don't need any libraries. Um, Yes, that's it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>